once in a while hear like, oh, Paul McCartney likes the show, or Sting likes the show, or the president likes the show, and it's just, it's just mind blowing that that you would ever even be on someone like that's radar. I guess to me, it just is so surreal. I went over Matt's house for his birthday, and he said, I got something to show you. I'm very proud of this. And on the wall, he's got a lovely postcard from Obama. Oh, dear Matthew, Matt. With Mr. One, whatever. How we enjoy Mad Men. We so appreciate it. We're up, we're all done with season three, and we look forward to season four. I think Matt went right to the office and sent him season four. <laughs> I mean, it blows your mind. I remember meeting um, Tom Hanks and, and, and his lovely wife, and they had what fans of the show, and that blew my mind because I'm a huge fan of his. And I hear Meryl Streep watches the show, which blows my mind. I love her. Um, so, and yes, the leader of the free world is watching Mad Men, which is, you don't get better than that. When the president writes you a letter, that's, that's an awfully nice endorsement. Uh, and we, um, we've, we've been very fortunate. We've just been incredibly fortunate to, to have the show be recognized in the way that it has. And yet we've been able to be true to the, to the story and the, and the world we want to, we want to, uh, uh, be faithful to. And so. We haven't had to compromise a lot, and yet we've been able to, to impact in the way that we wanted. So it's, it's, it's been an amazing run. And you must be Donald Draper. Don. Bob. We're very, very excited you had time to meet with us, Don. Murray told us why and had done glow coat. Turns out everybody in New York except him knows it's you. And I think they're a little jealous. Can't tell who the client is here. <laughs>